What's going on gamers? Today we're going to be learning about mod pack add-ons that Apex offers with its servers. But before we get into the tutorial, don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you can get notified of new videos we upload just like this one. One of the best ways to enjoy Minecraft is by customizing it with mods. This is why we have many one-click install mod packs available on our game panel. However, you may want to use your own mod packs or a custom mod pack. Creating a custom mod pack can be difficult as there are many complications to it, such as the mod versions, having dependencies, knowing what mods work with each other, and more. That's why here at Apex we've created the mod pack creation add-on. This allows you to just send us the mods and have our team of professionals create the mod pack for you and install it server side. We're going to be breaking down how you can get the add-on and how to use it. There are two types of mod pack creation add-ons that we have. The starter plan allows you to send us up to 25 mods. However, you can get the mod pack creation pro, which will allow you to send us up to 50 mods. The mod pack creation starter plan is a one-time fee of $15 USD and the mod pack creation pro plan is a one-time fee of $25 USD. When you're purchasing your server, you're going to see the mod pack add-on during the checkout process. If you're working with a four gigabyte server, or if this is the one that you're going to purchase, when you scroll down on the page, you're going to see two options for the add-on. The mod pack creation pro, which is a $25 one-time purchase will allow you up to 50 mods. Now, I want to note that this version of the add-on only works for 4 gigabyte and above. It will not show up when you go to purchase a 2 gigabyte server. If you have a 2 gigabyte server, the option that will show up to you is the mod pack creation starter add-on for a one-time purchase of $15. This will allow you up to 25 mods. But if you already own a server and you want to get this add-on, go ahead and jump into billing, click on the services box, and then on the bottom left, go ahead and view available add-ons. From here, you're going to see all four options for the add-ons that we offer. All you need to do is pick the one that you want, whether it's the Creation Starter or the Creation Pro, and make sure to order now. Go ahead and finish the checkout process, and once you finish checking out, you're going to receive an email with instructions on how to use this add-on. Go ahead and head to the billing area. Once you're in the billing area, go ahead and click on the Tickets tab. And once you're on the tickets page, go ahead and click on open ticket. You should see a list of different tickets. Go ahead and choose or click on mod pack creation add on. And once you're here, there's a couple of things you're going to need to fill out. For example, under game version, select the version that you will want your server to run. Keep in mind that your world may need to be reset in order to add the mods. In the mod list section, you're going to need to choose some mods for your server. The mods you choose need to come from a trusted site. It's highly recommended that you use the ones from CurseForge. When choosing mods from CurseForge, you must check that you are linking a version compatible for your Minecraft server. You can do that by clicking on all versions and then clicking the one that is for your server. Once you've selected a mod that you want for your server, you can go ahead and click on the mod page. And then what you wanna do is jump to relations and make sure that you link any dependency mods that you can find. You can do this by clicking on dependencies. It also helps if you change from all types to required dependency because you may not need anything that shows up here by default. Once you find each mod, go ahead and copy the link and paste it into your mod link list. Once you've pasted the link to all of the mods, go ahead and confirm that you're not a robot and submit your ticket. Mod packs can be quite troublesome and time consuming to create. Luckily, with this add on, you're able to get your dream mod pack created with little trouble and effort. It is important to remember that mods and plugins aren't compatible with each other, so you're not going to be able to add any bucket plugins to your server. Another thing to note is that the mod pack must be installed client side. Our team will take care of the server side installation for you. Once the mod pack is done, you're going to receive a response on the submitted ticket with instructions on how you can install it client side. Well, folks, that's all I've got for you today. I want to thank you for using an Apex server and want to thank you for using this tutorial. And as always, I hope you have lots of fun.